If you need to update your deck, go to 50cards.shop. Get 5% off your next purchase when you use code NEXUS. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. And today we're gonna to be opening up a box of Festival Booster 2023. This is a highly anticipated box because of the two over triggers on the front. We got some necessary reprints. Before getting into the unboxing, I quickly want to talk about our sponsor, which is 50 Cards, which if you haven't heard already, 50 Cards has bundles, booster boxes, they sell singles. They also have Shadowverse. So if you want to pick up some Shadowverse singles, you can go to 50 Cards, pick them up there. The biggest thing that I love about 50 Cards is the fact that if you go to their nation bundles, you can pick up a full play set of every single card you need for an upcoming booster set. The most recent one they have right now is for DBT 13. You can go on, pick up all the stuff you need, full play sets of whatever nation you need. So go ahead, check that out. And you can use code Nexus to get 5% off checkout as well. One more thing I wanted to mention before getting to the unboxing is we're doing a giveaway. So we have one we're gonna be unboxing for the channel and another one we're gonna be doing to one lucky winner. So we'll have the rules and the details in the description below. We're working on trying to get the video up to 200 likes. So if you can get this video up to 200 likes, we'll be giving away a box to one lucky winner. And without further ado, let's get right into the unboxing. All right, getting into the Festival Booster 2023 unboxing. Little details about some cards you can expect, what the ratios are. It's three cards per pack. There's 18 packs. Low ratios in terms of what our pulls can be, but this is a highly anticipated box for not just the OTs, but also all the new Lyrical Melody support as well. So we gonna be seeing a lot of Lyrical Melody cards in this set. Go ahead and pop this open. Got a little promotional banner thing for Groovy and yeah, Bang Dream, and then obviously advertising the Will Dress anime. So there are no box toppers in here, but we do have our 10 packs. I don't know if I said 10 or 18, but I meant to say 10. <laughs> so it's 10 packs, three cards per pack. So we're just gonna go ahead and jump right into cracking these open. New heel trigger, new heel trigger. Oh, starting right off the bat, we got our Bashilan. So we got some new grade, you know, they're kind of like Easter themed lyrical melody cards. This is really, really shiny. So you got a ton of these sitting around. So I'm just gonna throw this aside to the triple R pile and put this over the side to the trigger pile. Draw trigger, reprint for the ride lines. So also the Leanne Orn, Dry Jewel, and Youth Burk ride lines got some reprints. So you don't just have to pick up trial decks. And cool, we got our Overlord uh, reprint, which is really, really cool. So Halby was a promo that was really needed for the Overlord deck. Um, and now that we got as a reprint, that's really helpful for players that want to build Overlord. This is still a really, really high value card, even though it's being reprinted. But I, I guess, you know, Trying to pull one card out of a pack of three makes it a little bit difficult. Trigger, dredge old reprint. Oh, cool, Sages, nice. Put Sages over here and put the triggers over here. Next pack. Trigger, Leanne Orn stuff, and uh, double R for our uh, friends at Lyrical Melody. Or Lyrical Monasterio. <laughs> Did I have been saying Lyrical Melody this whole time? Lyrical Monasterio. Okay, Aqua Force looking trigger. Another Lyrical trigger. And a reprint for uh, Stoicaeus. This is the one where units can't be chosen in the same column. So I guess that can still be helpful going down the line. Is that a foil trigger? So we got a heal, a draw. Oh, this is the uh, the trigger that gets shield. So this is a reprint of, so we got the reprints of these skill triggers as well. So the crit, the front, the draw. So this is for uh, lyrical as well. Put our triggers to the side. All right. Got another youth reprint, got a heal and a, another lyrical double R. Keeping it going, Let's see what we got. Dread Jeweled reprint. Uh, ooh, we've got the alt art for Marjorie. So Marjorie, Fasado, and Arcs got reprints as well, but they have alt arts. And another Lyrical Double R. Put those aside. Let's see, 
trigger, trigger. Oh, cool. Draw trigger reprint. Nice. And all the skill triggers come in this double R foil, which is really, really cool. So put that to the side. And this is the last pack because we're only working with 10 packs in this unboxing. Got our crit. Leanne Norn reprint. Oh, look at that. We got the uh, the blue over trigger. So this is Spiritual King of Aquatics, Eater Sparrow. So what this does is it gives a unit a crit and you can pick a card from your drop and add it back to your hand. This, this one's kind of underrated compared to the red over trigger, but I like this one a lot as well, just because it's a ninth crit in your standard deck. And you just never know if you need a deck that needs to add stuff to your hand. Like for me, I like this card in Minerva because it can add a Genesis unit back to my hand. So this is also really cool. All right, so let's go real quickly over what our pulls were like for our triple R's. We got uh, the Aquatics, Edostra, Edostraro, Edostraro, Sages, our Howies. We have Vashablan. So I believe these are all of our triple R's. Double R's, we got Trixie and Kure, and then we also have Fortrude. We got some reprints as well. We got Marjorie, and we got Virjula, and then we got some triggers as well. So we got the Brant Gate, Draw Trigger, and we got the Lyrical Monasterio Front Trigger and reprints as well. Uh, like I said, lots of Lyrical cards, but uh, the biggest takeaways from this, I feel like, are definitely going to be these three. This for my uh, Lyrico Monasterio enjoyers, but the Halby is probably the biggest thing that we just pulled in this box. Pretty fun set. And I'm looking forward to the fact that these reprints are gonna give players a lot of access to play more fun decks and you know, being able to try out these new over triggers as well is gonna make the game a little more fun. We unfortunately didn't pull any of the new Regalis pieces like the Forbidal or the Sphere. Um, those are also gonna make standard uh, a little more interesting. So looking forward to seeing how those shape the English meta here. Also real quickly, just wanted to thank our sponsor again, which is 50 Cards. So be sure to check out their online store, check out their bundles, check out the Shadowverse stuff. And as an additional reminder, we still are gonna be trying to give away the Box of Festival booster. So if this video can get up to 200 likes, we'll go ahead and put the link in the description below for the rules and details about entering for the giveaway. So as soon as we get the video up to 200 likes, that link will be in the description for you guys to enter. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.